Happy Monday. Today is Monday, October the 10th, 2022. Today's daily Bible readings are for the semi-continuous ones. That means like from here on out to Advent, right? It's this kind of kind of continuous thread where it's like following one story throughout the whole Bible. Um, and if you had read that starting back with, you know, right after Trinity Sunday, you kind of got like, a, you know, six months through the Old Testament. Um, kind of cool or the Bible in general. But anyway, I digress. Our semi-continuous text for today are Psalm 102, 1 through 17, Jeremiah 29, 8 through 23, and then you could have read Acts 26, 24 through 29. And then once again, complementary text, which I've described, explained before, complementing yesterday's texts for Sunday. Psalm 61, 2 Kings 5, 15 through 19, A. And then you could end with Acts 26, 24 through 29. Again, I'm going to keep up with our friend Malcolm and read his sonnet for his sonnet. For, I mixed psalm and sonnet. I need more coffee. Anyway, his sonnet for Psalm 61 today, uh, which is Exaudi Deus. Um, and so I will, as usual, read the psalm. And then read Exaudi Deus. And the psalm today is just so good because uh, Mondays are when we do our event called The Function, which is basically an open mic and Christian coffee house, live music kind of jam session with food. Um, and so it's basically just a lot of people getting together and playing instruments and uh, singing and reading scripture and things like that. Um, just uh, kind of like a safe place for people to come express their faith and express their creativity in a Christian atmosphere. So uh, if you're a college student in Chattanooga or an otherwise young adult and you'd like to participate that and just sit and listen and eat some free pizza or just participate in the band, you should come by Bethlehem Wiley Church tonight and uh, just uh, after six o'clock and we'll hook you up. But anyway, that's why Psalm 61 is so good today because it's to the leader with stringed instruments, and we've got a bunch of those. We also have trumpets and stuff, so hey, man, it's like a you know value-added product. But anyway, Psalm 61. To the leader with stringed instruments of David. Hear my cry, O God. Listen to my prayer. From the end of the earth I call to you when my heart is faint. Lead me to the rock that is higher than I, for you are my refuge, a strong tower against the enemy. Let me abide in your tent forever. Find refuge under the shelter of your wings. For you, O God, have heard my vows. You have given me the heritage of those who fear your name. Prolong the life of the king. May his years endure to all generations. May he be enthroned forever before God, appoint steadfast love and faithfulness to watch over him. So I will always sing praises to your name as I pay my vows day after day. And now, Exaudi Deus, uh, Malcolm Geitz, sonnet in response to Psalm 61. Hear us, we cry, and once more make us glad from every corner of the earth we call. From heavy hearts, from weary souls, and sad, our cries ascend towards your holy hill. O oh, lift us up and set us on the rock, on something higher than our wavering will. And free us from the traps of time, the clock that counts us down to nothing, the false hope, the game plan, and trajectory, the lock that closes out your grace. Help us look up and see the shimmer of the angels' wings, and in between the cherubim, the cup of our salvation, and the King of kings come down to share himself in bread and wine. Draw back the veil until our spirit sings. Exaudi Deus by Malcolm Geit, in response to our Psalm of the Day, Psalm 61. Anyway, that's the DBR for today. Get out, enjoy the day. Get some stringed instruments and praise God some. Anyway, that's the DBR. See you tomorrow. Boop.